the Greenwich Board of Selectmen had the opportunity to tour the proposed site plan for a new New Lebanon Elementary School. This plan is called Scheme C and is the only plan that has the support of the Board of Education. What the Board of Selectmen is most concerned about is that prior to making a decision that we're well versed in what it is that's being proposed. The plan calls for a new 58,000 square foot building to be constructed behind the current building, meaning it would be at a much lower elevation and much closer to I-95. But this plan avoids using up playing field space and the children would be able to stay in the current school during the construction phase. There is no way that they should be displaced. Um, that would be a, a huge mistake for kids that need um, every bit of learning time that they possibly can have. Well, this building, it, it, it's a good school, it's a neat school, it's a clean school. It's going to be the school until we sort out what will be the new building. It's very important the building being, be in great shape. Superintendent of Schools Dr. William McCursey pointed out to everyone on the tour the work that has already been done as part of the town's curb appeal project. So we wanted to make sure the schools on the outside, which are the park's responsibility, the town's responsibility, that they look great. First selectman Peter Tessie said the tour was helpful for everyone involved. Clearly everyone is in support of a modernized facility. Uh, it's just making sure that it's well thought out, it not only meets the needs, but that we're not embarking on another capital project that has um, unintended consequences. The uh, teachers, the faculty, and the students above all have been incredibly resilient in all of this process. But you know, there comes a time when you have to say, "Listen, enough is enough. Let's get let's get working on this. Let's get the project moving forward." The board of selectmen is waiting on more soil test results and tentatively has scheduled a vote for municipal improvement on May 28th. Reporting for the Greenwich Sentinel, I'm Taylor Knight.